A somber vigil held tonight honoring the life of a 16-year-old. Davion Gibson is one of three Sin High School students shot Wednesday after school. Davion killed in that attack. And Jewel Hillary is joining us live from the 19th Police District with more on how he is being remembered tonight. Jewel. Hi, good evening, Micah and Bray. A huge crowd came out tonight for a balloon release to show their love for Davion Gibson and his grieving family. The high school student who has been described as extremely respectful and kind meant the world to his loved ones who are now in disbelief that they're preparing for his funeral. Okay, my baby, baby was getting my Take best friend. <laughs> they were my best friend. My baby was everything to me. Overwhelming grief and sadness filled the 1400 block of North Tallman Avenue Friday night as 16 year old Davion Gibson's family and friends released dozens of heart shaped balloons in his honor. If I knew it was going to be my last day with my grandson, I would have hugged him and hugged him and hugged him. Davion, a Sin High School student, was shot and killed near the school Wednesday afternoon, shortly after dismissal. Two other boys survived the shooting. Davion's family says he wasn't involved in the streets, but was family oriented. He loved dancing and aspired to become a veterinarian. My grandson get out of school at 315. He, he get out at 315. He's home at 325 every day. That particular day, he never made it home. Davion was the oldest of three boys. His brother Tremaine says the day of the shooting, Davion helped dress him for his eighth grade picture. It would never be the same when I'm my oldest brother gone. <laughs> he told me everything. It was my protector. In the midst of heartbreak. It was this day, Lord, our daily bread. The family is pleading for the suspects to turn themselves in. I'm going to tell you, I'm going to get justice for him. And I will be at the court date every day every visit. Turn yourself in. Turn yourself in. This is killing me. Community activist Andrew Holmes says a $2,000 reward is available to anyone who can help lead authorities to arrest and the conviction of the people responsible for Wednesday shooting. Anyone with details on what happened can leave anonymous tips with CPD. You can also call the number 1 800 the letter U tell us. Davion's grandmother tells me that his funeral service is scheduled for next Friday. Reporting live from the 19th Police Headquarters, I'm Jewel Hillary, WGN News. Thank you, Jewel.